Hi, I am Anna. I come from www.ntvforex.com. Brexit bill first debate and tech stock sell off analysis http ntvforex.com news id ac 45439142026 am tech stocks had their worst weekly drop since March led by Apple, which fell 6.9%. The British pound will be sensitive to the first UK Parliament debate of the controversial internal markets bill. Markets The major US stock indexes fell for the second week in a row as technology stocks experienced their worst pullback since March. The market was volatile in a holiday-shortened week, with the Nasdaq posting a 4% decline on Tuesday followed by a nearly 3% gain on Wednesday. NBSP meanwhile, stocks in Europe rose 1.7% on the continuing economic recovery, shaking off the resurgence in COVID infections across the continent renewed fears of a hard Brexit and the disappointment that the ECB did not announce additional stimulus. In commodities, crude oil prices dropped for the second week in a row, sinking below $40 per barrel for the first time since July. Gold managed modest gains on the week while silver futures limped modestly lower on the week, unable to hold $27. NBSP on NBSP The Currencies Front the euro surged after the ECB president expressed optimism for the continent's economic recovery. Cable recorded its worst week since March as EU-UK discussion on Brexit seems to go into another impasse. NBSP Asian stocks firmed on Monday morning on renewed hopes for a COVID vaccine after AstraZeneca resumed its Phase 3 trial. Day ahead themes for the day ahead are ongoing sell-off in US tech stocks and the first debate on the Brexit inspired a internal markets bill in the UK Parliament. There is also industrial production data from Japan and the EU, inflation data from India and earnings from US home builder Lenner. Tech stocks just had their worst week since March, with Apple leading the losses down 6.9%. For those waiting for a pullback to buy tech at better prices, here you have it but of course there is always the question of whether the pullback has further to go. The Apple product launch is on Wednesday so I will touch on that tomorrow. As a reminder, the internal market bill addresses the Northern Ireland Protocol A formerly known as the Irish backstop, which caused so many issues in the Brexit deal passing in the first place A and is back causing problems again. If it became law it would give UK ministers powers to A disapply rules in the Brexit deal relating to Ireland from January 1st, if the UK and EU are unable to strike a trade deal. The EU says the planned changes must be scrapped or they risk jeopardising the UK-EU trade talks but the UK government is pressing ahead with it anyway. Japanese industrial production is expected to have dropped a hefty 16.1% year-over-year in July. For the Eurozone we re-looking at an even worse 18.3% and down from the 12.3% in June. Indian CPI is forecast to remain above the central bank S target range in August. US home builder Lenner is expected to show earnings of $1.55 per share compared to $1.59 from the same quarter last year. Sales are set to decrease by 9% to $5.33 billion. But given the mini housing boom going on in the US, where house prices just averaged over $300,000 for the first time ever guidance should be better. Subscribe our channel to receive the news as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. If you want to read real-time news, text messages to MT5 Expert Advisors page at httpsm.me mt5.expert.advisors.